Cheaper by the Dozen is the true story of Frank Gilbreth and his wife Lillian Mahler, who were early uh, engineers. They, their, their focus was on saving time in factories. In fact, there's a quote in the play where uh, Dr. Gilbreth said to, Dr. to President Wilson, the war's been declared. If you don't know how to use me, I'll be there in a little while and, you, and I'll tell you how to use me. And he did that. He was very, um, he was early on in that kind of thing. He had 12 children. And the amazing thing to me is he died while the first, oldest child was the first, she was in college. She was, wasn't but 16 because she'd skipped so many grades. And even though he died when she was uh, in college, Mrs. Mahler, was able to get the rest of them through college. Every child graduated. Now we couldn't even say that in today's time that a single parent mom could get all 11 children out. He had instilled in them the value of an education. I play Joe Scales and Larry doesn't have a last name. Uh, I actually play Frank Gilbreth, the pretty much oldest boy out of the dozen of children and he, with another girl out of the out of the dozen of children, actually wrote this play. My name is Diana Smith, and I'm the mother, Miss Gilbert, in the play. My name is Brendan Forrest. I'm Frank Gilbert in the play, She Provides Dozen. She's the youngest in the family. We've been at a bunch of plays together. Um, Alice in Wonderland, Wizard of Oz. Oz. And this one, Cheaper by the Dozen. Yeah, Cheaper by the Dozen. I just really like the mindset of it, and I just like how the story goes and how funny and comedy it is. I like it. I like the family dynamic and everyone who's in the show. They're great and positive, and I love them. It is just one of the funniest stories I've ever seen. Gilbert was over the top and what he expected from the children. And their reaction to that is just really fun, how they handled what he wanted from them. Not very clean. <clears throat> Looks like uh, you've been biting them. Needs washing. You see these children here, they are absolutely the most wonderful children. I feel like that. I feel like I'm Lillian Mahler. These are my children. And they are wonderful, every one of them. We've got one that's six years old over here, all the way up to a high school senior over here. So it's, it's certainly a variety. Well, the show is October 3rd and 4th. It starts at 7.30 and everybody needs to bring their lawn chairs to sit because we're in the park. And tickets will be available at Miss Mertz and at Center Drugs.